So one of the best examples in my community that I can provide of the social development strategy in action is an after-school program that we call STAR. STAR stands for Skills, Training, and Recognition. Very like the social development strategy uh, nomenclature there. The social development strategy that is implemented through the STAR program um, has directly impacted the work that I do um, with kids, regardless of the program that I'm working with them on. Um, so, you know, teaching them a solid skill um, and letting them own it, um, empowering them to feel like, yeah, I can do this, and they feeling good about themselves, and doing that with the recognition of not just saying, hey, good job, but hey, Josh, you did a really great job um, working with that science model. So the STAR celebration is where we bring the community together to celebrate the kids' learning and the opportunities and the achievements they've, that they've made. By graduating the program tonight, um, receiving their STAR t-shirt, receiving their certificate, and receiving the recognition gift um, from the class instructor, the kids will know that, and their parents will know, that I have completed all of the steps all of the mastery techniques for their subject matter in a way that is very positive and reassuring. You see these children, you know, they start off in the fifth grade and then as they grow uh, through the eighth grade and out of the STAR program and then beyond into high school, you really get to watch them grow up. And, and it's easy to pick out the kids who have been very well vested in the STAR program. Uh, they've got a different aura about them. They are very positive, very confident, um, and in a, in a way that they're not, they're treating others very nicely. Uh, they're learning manners, and it's, it's just a treat to see them in the public place. When you focus on the positive things that kids do as opposed to the negative things that they do. Their whole, their whole demeanor shifts if they're accustomed to just hearing no, 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 bad, bad, bad. And then you're like, no, good, well done. I like how you've done that. Um, it's, it's a paradigm shift for them and it really changes their outlook and helps them feel better about themselves. It has helped me in working with my staff because I apply it to them and the work that they're doing with children. And so I'm recognizing them throughout the course of their work in how they're teaching their lessons, how they're working with camper behaviors, dealing with staff issues um, and any other issues that might arrive or challenging situations and all of those wonderful positive situations as well. Um, and so the staff become my students and I apply many of the tenets of the skills-based recognition directly to them, which then they apply to their campers. And so it's a, a trickle-down method that in my role modeling to them, they then are able to more easily role model to the campers and we have a very positive work environment for us all.